Hey guys and girls, and thank you for watching another episode of the Xbox Tester. My name is Maurice. Today, we're going to play the Eternal Cylinder on Xbox Series S. So, yeah, this game already came out like last year or so, and it finally got a new gen upgrade. So, uh, yeah, without further ado, let's just dive in. First of all, let's see how much data the game is, and that's 8.5 GB. The game is not on Game Pass, and it's like 25 euros. I think that's a pretty fair price. The game is optimized for new generation of console, Gen Scarlet, Xbox Gen 9, and let's go start it up. You guys, if you like this kind of content, don't forget to like and subscribe to the channel. It means a lot for me, you really helping out this channel. You can also hit the bell icon. I upload almost on a yeah, daily basis. New games, old games, updates on games, even a little bit of hardware here and there. So, Good Shepherd Entertainment. By the way, big shout out to the publisher for sending me a key for this game. So I can could do a first look on my channel. Yeah, sure. I'm going to do a new game. So... Yes. Once upon a time, in the age of the Once internal time, cylinder, the age of the eternal there lived a cylinder, family of little creatures. Of little creatures called Hold the to tenor. skip the cinematic. We're Trevor not here not the for the cinematic. At first I thought it looked a lot like Spore. I don't know if you guys still know that game. It came out like maybe 20 years ago or something. But it felt like, I, I don't know, somehow I got this feeling like it has a little bit of a spore feeling. So, the eternal cylinder. Run, something inside him said, run. It's like a really strange game. Graphically, I must say I'm not, it, it is 60 FPS all the way through, but it looks so incredibly blurry. I don't know what they did with these graphics, but oh my goodness, it's not sharp at all. It's like one big blurry mess. And that's pretty sad because it's a really fun little game to play. So there the eternal cylinder comes through. Oh no. What to do? What do we do? Black. The great crushing thing, the great cylinder had stopped. Perhaps it was... And I don't think there are any uh, graphical modes. To use its legs. Invert Y. I am an inverted player. But these ah, motion blur off. So Field of view. Remembered. Yeah, that's okay, Perhaps, I think. The little Trebum thought Ply. They were a Maybe it helps. Voice it mm. in its mind. That Not that much. Kind of memory. I must say, it looks a little better with motion blur off. Not that much, but... Now we have jumping legs. Just when How cool is this? I think it's really legs. fun. The food from the jumping so you can upgrade stuff with the right substance as a for your character, of course. Can transform and adapt to many challenges. The Trebum was drawn to a bright light, or perhaps to the creature next to it. There's Except this the old grass guy on the laying around. Head, they were very much alike. Surrounded, Surrounded by this by light, the Trevor knew things it had not known before. Knew things it had not known before. It knew the older Trebum had carried this light for a long, long time. 
and it knew that now that and I've heard crazy good things about this generation. game by the way yes this young treble and it's really really big great towers in the distance it could have stayed here to learn many old things but the uh -oh. cylinder would not allow it uh oh oh no 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 Run, the inner voice said. Run. The towers would not stop the cylinder unless they were activated. Here we go. Step on the cylinder symbol. Quickly. The Trebom had to step on the symbol or the cylinder would not be stopped. Pretty insane what happens now. Want to see what happens with those mountains? Look at it. It's some some. And that's like the eternal cylinder every time it rolls around the world. And uh, yeah. It gets a chance for new life, I think. comes Ooh, that's close the voice inside the Trebum's memories assured it that while the tower stood the Trebum and now we can finally yeah the power of the like start cylinder was the game for now discover everything hello mr. snail I love the, the character designs, by the way. Gave the Looks Trebum gorgeous. Think about its family. Really, really gorgeous. Alone, so, where were the others? Our young friend had found an egg, a Trebum egg, with one of his siblings inside. The egg had been. Now let's see. But it could still be <gasps> I found a new All friend was a source of heat. new family member joins the group so now I've got a new buddy to help me out with all these things in this world but look at it I think it looks gorgeous by the way the world building of this Really strange alien planet. What happens when I eat that? Nothing. And now you have to just discover the world. discover what's going on and uh, yeah help out life on this planet and yeah I love it A really relaxing game but it's a hard game it's it's definitely a game you must be dedicated to play definitely a hidden gem like they say where to go? <coughs> okay. It was hard for the Trevum to Still too what young. To do or where wow, to look at those creatures in the, in the, the distance. I thought that was a tree at first. Right but Find wow. Path, That's said. cool. You must follow the beam of light that emanates from the tip of the tower. That's something. I want to see it up close. Where the old things dwell. Can I see it up close? Is that a creature too? No, that's not a creature. It can't be. Hey, some other. What are these guys doing? Whoop. 
But yeah, you guys, this is the Eternal Cylinder running on Xbox Series S. And yeah, I think the game looks gorgeous. But yeah, it is a... a yeah, I think you, you definitely need to have a dedicated taste for a game like this. It's, it is something else than your standard shooter or anything like that. I really want to thank you for watching. I hope you had fun. And I hope to see you guys soon in another one. Whoa, 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 we were. What the freaky deaky do was that? That's one ugly alien. But yeah, till next time. Bye.